Hey, hello everybody. Welcome to Greenhorn Barbecue Beer. My name is Todd. I'm the Sassy Kitchen Queen. And we got a special treat for you tonight. We're going to prepare some burgers. Where? Yeah, we're going <laughs> to... I'm going to prepare some burgers. She's going to watch. Why, oh, really? So, a few days ago, well, actually earlier today, we bought a Cuisinart circular griddle kind of cooktop thing. It's a poor man's Evo. Uh, we got it on sale at a local store, pretty cheap actually. Um, it's a good time of year to start buying some barbecue equipment and grills and things. For under $200. So uh, we'll do a card and a link uh, down there in the description to the video of us unboxing it and stuff like that. And, so go check it out. But at any rate, we're going to go ahead and get our burgers ready here. All right, so what we got here is some 80-20. See, we've... Woo! Close up. So this is uh, serving us well. We we did some uh, a test cook earlier today with uh, this stuff. I'm gonna make uh, a few balls here, <laughs> and I'm gonna do basically smash style burgers. And I'm going for I don't know that looks like about eight. That's about six ounces. Yeah, that's exactly what I'm going for. So I'm not gonna pack it very tight, but uh, I want it in a ball. Now, ideally, if you have time and forethought, uh, it's better to do this the night before and let it set up um, if you're gonna do it. But uh, since we're gonna be making smash burgers, this is basically all we gotta do. We also got some buttered lettuce, some uh, red onion, and some nice- uh, Beef steak tomatoes. Beef steak tomatoes, and some uh, interesting sauces over here. I'm not gonna touch it because uh, I just touched the meat. Um, we also have some brioche buns, and we're going to saute some onions, of course. Um, Deb's got one of her favorite cheeses. I'm not sure what kind of cheese that Smoke is. Smoke white cheddar. Smoke white cheddar, and of course, I'm an all-American kind of guy. Some white, some white cheese. <laughs> some white cheese. <laughs> Poor man's white cheese. <laughs> Poor man's white cheese. So... A very wise chef actually told me that, uh, uh, told actually the world, his name's Sam the Cooking Guy, plugged him. I don't know him, he doesn't know me, but uh, uh, he's got a lot of great burger tutorials and uh, he swears by American cheese. And last few burger tutorials we did, I used American cheese. And I tell you, you know, it, it doesn't uh, cool off and turn into a kind of crust or whatever, or or get hard or whatever, it stays nice and juicy and gooey and stuff like that, and that's what I like. Of course, uh, white cheddar, uh, it does maybe close to the same thing, but... Uh, Stop touching my cheese. Okay, so we also have some Japanese mayo. It's called wasabayo. What's up, yo? See, yo, 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 okay. Um, and then some uh, tattoo. See, so if I pour it on my arm, I'm gonna get a tattoo, so that's, that's where that came from right there. And then I'm not sure if she's going to use this stuff right here. Babe, are you using this stuff? Yes, I'm going to try some. This is some pr pretty exotic I picked, stuff. I picked those up today. I saw them and I thought they looked interesting. I was really trying to find the Japanese oh, mayo. Don't get so close. I am not so close. It's on the bottles. What are you freaking out about? So, it's so, so exotic. I don't even know what it's called. Tattoo hot sauce, avocado, and serrano. So that's kind of cool. And then habanero uh, condiment. Okay, so these are condiments. So, all right. So... Meet us out by the grill. All right, so I believe the cornerstone to any good burger is some sauteed onions, so. Go ahead and season this. Get a little oil going here. I'm gonna go ahead and oil the whole damn thing, you know, cause yeah, that's brand new. This is kind of its uh, first time, first time out the gate here. So we're gonna get some oil going on here. So this is, this is avocado oil. It's got a very high, Burn point. Uh, all right. Oh yeah. Already smells like a diner. Okay, got some onions here. All right. So this is a little cooler on this side. Going nice right there. Gonna get a little bit of dry vermouth. So this is what's gonna separate 
basically the run of the mill sauteed onions from the really good ones. Oh yeah. A little bit of salt. A little bit of pepper. Okay. And this is the smash part. All right, and the reason I smashed them is because all these little nooks and crannies here is gonna spread that flavor and all them juices throughout the meat. You want that char, you want that. So it's gonna taste really good. And yeah, really nice. Onions are looking good. Yeah. And I'm just gonna let those simmer a little bit. All right, so it's a smash burger. Okay, so over here, might as well. Now, don't put butter on your buns. It's gonna, it's gonna get them soggy. Uh, just, I'm just gonna throw them on the edge here. Let them get browned up a little bit. What we're looking for is a little bit of brown coming up the edges. Couple minutes, a couple minutes per side. But we're definitely going for well done on these. Onions are looking really good. Okay. A little salt, a little pepper. Always want to season uh, your burgers. Okay, buns are looking really good. Okay. Make sure that you toast your buns. The toasting is going to protect the bun from getting too soggy from all those condiments and things that you put on it. Okay. These are looking really nice. Okay, let's see. Those buns are good now. That oil definitely helped heat up the surface. Not sure what the science is here, but I'm looking at about 450 right here. This uh, side here I've had on mediums right around 400. Right in the middle, about 300. And right over by me, about 400. So I have this side up high, I've had it up high. I'm gonna go ahead and turn them all up right now. Okay. How's that smell, baby? It smells good. Sure does. Yeah, a little bit more oil on them. Okay. 
go ahead and speed up the onions a little bit, kind of let them cook for a while. Hmm. A little bit of vermouth. Hell yeah. If you guys have never tried vermouth. This is what separates the men from the boys right here. Deb's rolling her eyes because she doesn't believe so. You know her, her, uh, her favorite cooking guy uses it all the time. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and put these over now. Okay, again, a little salt, a little pepper. All right, you guys, you've heard me say it before. Make sure you season your meat and your buns. Season everything at every process. You're not going to over salt it. Just a little bit of salt, a little bit of pepper, and you will be surprised. It will waken up your dish, trust me. Okay, let's check out these onions. Oh, those onions are starting to look pretty good. Not quite, quite getting down to where I like them, but not bad. Not bad. It's starting to smell really good. Oh, yeah? I think that will help. All right. Uh, if you guys could smell this stuff right now, oh my god, that is just so awesome. Okay, let's get some cheese on these now. Okay, I like American. I always go with two pieces of American. And Deb's white cheddar. Smoked white cheddar. Smoked white cheddar, yeah. There we go. All right, guys, we're going to let these cook up in a minute. It's already starting to melt. I'm going to shut it down and meet you guys inside. Okay, babe, why don't you plate up yours first? Okay. I'm going to start with a little Boston some butter lettuce here. Oh, it looks delicious. Okay, we're gonna put this on the bottom. Then we're going to put some of these nice onions. I like my onions raw. I like the crunch. And then I'm going to just grab my burger with my melted beautiful cheese here. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to put two pieces of tomato because, well, three pieces of tomato because I, well, let me see, I love tomato. Then I'm going to put some salt. And I'll put some pepper. Uh-oh, I forgot my sauce. <laughs> okay, we're going to, we're going to put some sauce right here, okay? We're going to put it all, all over the top bun. Then I'm going to try this uh, Tattoo Hot Sauce Avocado Serrat um, Serrano, which looks absolutely amazing. I'm going to just put it all over my burger here. Mm. And then, and then, here's my burger. All right, don't eat yours yet. I'm going to make one now. I'm going to just put... Wow, look at that. It's falling apart. My burger could be a little bit different. I'm going to go with some of this. What's up, yo? Japanese... Oh, Japanese-style mayonnaise. I'm just going to put that a little bit on there. I don't think that's enough, actually. This stuff's kind of watery. Uh, I shook it up, but uh, it seems a little watery to me. So a little bit more on there. Oh. God, this stuff is really sloppy. Yum. All right, that looks good right there. And on the top, 
I definitely like avocado, so on the top I'm going to go with some of this avocado sauce. There we go. Spread that around a little bit. A little salt. A little pepper. All right. So what I like to do, get some of this butter lettuce. I'll break it up a little bit so it sits flat, makes a nice little bed. All right. And then what I'm going to do is I'm just going to take one piece of tomato and just lay it there like that. Grab my burger. That way it's got a nice flat little stand to sit on. Mmm. Oh, so good. Okay. You guys might think I'm crazy, but one more hit of salt. One more hit of pepper. You can kind of see it on there. Trust me on this. Then I'm going to do some of these wonderful sautés, caramelized onions. These things are just so awesome. Again, I had a little vermouth going on there. I'm going to taste one right now. Oh, my God. Those are so good. I'm going to cap it off. Smash it down. A little toothpick. <laughs> there we go. Look at that. All right, guys. Sassy wants to eat real bad right now, so. But you made me wait all day for this. It's freaking time to go to bed. Here we go. And mine, animal style, mm. all dripping with sauce. Oh my God. It's great. Mmm. What do you think of those sauces, babe? Pretty good. Mm. <clears throat> really good. Mm. Okay. All right, guys. Thanks a lot for watching us on this uh, quick burger night. Uh, it's uh, Saturday night, so we're going to get a burger on, then we're going to get a drink on. So, guys, be sure to subscribe, support the channel. We really appreciate it. Leave your comments down below, and be sure to check back often or ring the bell and you'll get an email alert that lets you know every time we upload. Right now we're planning on uploading every Wednesday and Friday and more often than we can. So we'll see you later. Bye.